Hi friends, it's Peepo here, but you should already know that. This is my YouTube channel, so let's get started. Today, we are playing a game called Beautiful Nightmare, as you can see. Um, this game is by Yahaha Studios, which is an incredible name. They emailed me about this game and asked if I would give it a try, and of course, it looked just up my alley, so we're gonna play it today. But they specifically asked for an honest review of the game, so that's what we're gonna do at the end. We're gonna play it and then we're gonna share our thoughts uh, and be very honest um, and not sugarcoated, I guess. So we'll see what happens, but I'm excited to jump in. I think this is gonna be really weird. Let's get into it. Oh, you hear that thunder? You might not because of the music, but I just had a loud peal of thunder. So brace yourselves. Nature is on our side today. Going to add bonus jump scares. Okay, <laughs> choose your avatar right off the bat. Not what you would expect from an indie horror game. It's very much giving Fortnite, but I love it. This is fun. Oh, she's very cute. I love her hair and her fishnets. So we're picking an avatar. I do believe that this is going to be a first person shooter type of game, which is very, <laughs> very unique and interesting. Uh, okay, so she's cute. I like that we're, we can pick people or these weird blah, these pickle people. I wish I could rotate them. I want to see what's happening in the, on the back here. Uh, cause I know his backpack, his backpack's french fries with glasses. Hmm. <sighs> I really like her. She's, I think, my favorite. She's very on, she's she's very the brand. Also, I have these shoes. These are my, these are my favorite shoes. I wear these with literally every outfit I own. So she's clearly, she's clearly that, that. She's that girl. Ooh, Pix Pixkira, that's a cute name. It's a very cute name, but I, I am obligated to change it. Sorry, it's Peep. Okay, I have no idea how to play. <laughs> I'm nervous. Room list? Wait, is this multiplayer? Oh my god, it is Fortnite. Are we gonna get dumped into a room? I hope there's not audio. I don't want a voice chat. Quick start? Oh, we'll see what happens. I might be quiet if, for a second. I don't wanna hear people talking. What if I have to talk to people? Oh no. Oh no. I didn't plan for that. Okay. Oh, all right. I'm on a bed. Oh look, a gun. Is that mine? Give me that. Can I have that? Oh God, homegirl doesn't know the controls. Oh, there's emotes. I can sit down and cry. How very me. Oh, good. Um, voice volume. Oh. Is that me? Live commenting. What does that mean? Should I close that? Maybe we close that. Uh, I'm gonna turn the voice volume down. And the space volume? I don't know. That makes me nervous. Let's try that. Uh, how do I take you? Ooh. The, uh, okay, jump. There's no tutorial. Is anyone gonna explain anything to me? It's so dark, I can't see. Help me, help, help, help. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna have to go to the website because I think the, I think the um, instructions are on the website, hold on. Oh God, I don't know how to play and there's no tutorial. Okay, first, first complaint. There's, I need a tutorial or very least some basic instructions in game. That's, that's my first thought. But otherwise, I like what we're working with. I like the music. I, um, I like the character selection screen. I think that's fun. We've yet to get to the gameplay part, but that's okay. All right, where's that email? Okay. All right, let's see. Wazda, got it. Jump away. E, 
or click the icon. I thought I did that. Okay. All right, I'll give it a go. <clears throat> All right, let's try that again. Click speaker to switch between audio channels in space. I don't want an, any audio channels. What? E? I'm pressing E. And I don't see, I can't click on what? Okay, so that wasn't exactly how I think that was supposed to work, but I managed to click on the icon, so I had to, um, whoa. I had to press the window, hold the window button to get my mouse on screen. Ooh. What is this? I am, um, I'm confused, to say the least, but that's very likely because I don't play many multiplayer horror games like this, so maybe maybe this would be a little bit more obvious to other people how to play. You know? What is this? Press keyboard E. Oh. <laughs> oh, I missed that. Seems I just fell asleep, but I don't know why I'm here. Looking at a disgusting, distorted world surrounded by the smell of death. I must find a way to escape from here. Okay. Uh, well, I can't go this way. And I can't go this way. I have to go. I have to go in here. Hello? Whoa. Okay. I clicked on it and now we're in. It's totally silent. Is that my fault? Let's see. Maybe we need to turn up the... Space volume is up. I don't know. Uh, hello? Okay. It's very quiet and a little funky. Um, the perspective being third person is causing some issues. I think first person would be more convenient for checking tight spaces. Oh, an elevator. However, huh? Then I guess you lose the fun of, click what icon? I can't, uh, what? Then you'd lose the fun of getting to pick your characters, what I'm trying to say. What's this trash can? What is this? What? Oh no, I want my, I want that gun. Sorry. <laughs> this is a mess. <laughs> um, I'm making a mess. I don't know why I can't use whatever is happening in here. I'm trying. I'm, hello. Uh, what is going on? Uh, what happened? Oh, I walked through a door. Yeah, I can't see where I'm going very well. I have to say, that's kind of a pain in the butt. And it's totally silent. Why is it so quiet? I can't just listen to the sound of my own voice, man. I feel like I need to play background music. I I am pressing it. What's happening? I can't see where I am, so I don't know what's going on. I am pressing E on my keyboard. Also, th that is not how doors work. <laughs> the handle is supposed to be, oh, the Mona Lisa. What? What is happening? Oh God. She won't let me look. I can't look up. I can't look up. She keeps glitching out. I don't know when the gameplay starts, but this is rough. This is rough so far. I'm having a hard time operating. Uh. There we go. There's something. Once again. Oh. All right. Once again, 
Not exactly how doors are supposed to work, but that's all right. Hello? Hello? Sure, sure thing. A uh, plant and uh, oh, another door and some sparkly bricks and uh, <clears throat> and a generator classic classic horror game oh and van gogh love it i always love to see what sort of paintings horror game developers choose to put in their games as space filling wall art um because it's it's always it's always classical paintings of course very interesting. All right, well, that's blood. I must be doing something wrong here. This very much does feel like a game intended to be multiplayer. Um, and there's this noticeable lack of people here, which makes it feel very empty. Plant. Okay, will you please open this door, please? I'm literally trying to do that. <laughs> Just watch, it's gonna end right here. That was it, that was our gameplay. What do you want? I'm clicking, I'm pressing, I'm doing things. I, I am, I am, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm pressing. I'm trying to press the elevator button. Maybe someone's meant to play as the villain. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. But also, I can't seem to fully explore this place. All right, all right, all right. I don't know what the emotes are for because I can't even play. Let's try this again. Let's try this again. We're gonna reload the world and see what happens. Um, she's very cute, but I think, I think we have to at least give little pickle person a shot. Because at the, if, if nothing, like, <laughs> the character selection is currently the only fun thing we get to do. So um, I'm at least going to take advantage of that. Give me that. I said give me that, please. <sighs> All right. Let's do it. Okay. Sometimes it's E and sometimes it is clicking with my mouse, but it is never consistent. This one's just not registering what I do at all. I don't know if that means it's supposed to be locked. Oh God, and, and our flashlight, our person doesn't like how tight these halls are. I can't see things very well. Why don't you do that? <laughs> I <laughs> I can't really play at this like this. If I can't open doors. Oh. <sighs> Were we missing something in here? Was it you? I have a gun, but apparently no bullets. We have a plant, which is neat, I guess. Plant. Oh, this is a pump. Whether you want to take it, I don't know. You get a pumper and the message is gone. I need just a little bit longer to read. Just a little bit longer to read because I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it now. We're in the bathroom again. All right, did I forget to check the toilets? I did, didn't I? Look at that. That's on me. Bloodstained piece of paper with the number three remaining on it, like a grim warning from the Grim Reaper. Okay, yeah, very grim from the Grim Reaper. Let's all say Grim one more time, I think. Grim. So, <laughs> I genuinely have no idea what the hell is happening. Welcome to the club. Welcome to the club. We have a generator, a pump generator. Oh, maybe that's what I need for the elevator. Maybe that's... Yo, yo. I, 
I want to go now. Thank you. What? Who's saying that? Stop saying it, maybe. Huh? Can I go? Can I leave? <laughs> the blinking is not helping. I don't know what's going on. I'm going to go to the elevator. I'm just going to go. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hello? <laughs> no? All right. Where does the... Where, please, stop blinking! Oh! Grim. Grim indeed. I don't like the blinking. It's... I understand it's supposed to be spooky, but I really dislike it. It's really hard to see what do I do with a pump generator should we just die and call it a day okay hello oh look this opened wow it opened cool oh blood door don't mind if I do never mind don't mind if I don't shut up plants plants are spooky Plants are spooky. Is the blinking forever? <laughs> Confusion is part of horror. I, I agree. I agree with you there. Always the Virgin Mary. But, uh, you know, within reason. A glowing bathtub. Cool, cool. That's fine. I'm chill with that. What's in here? A skeleton! It's Henry! Oh, Henry. What did I do? Did I take something? He's got a key. Can I have it? Hello? 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 Um... I'm trying. Uh, da, da, what? Look at my... Oh, little French fry backpack is having a good time. Good on him. I have to do something here, but I don't know what. When it tells me to, to click on something, nothing happens. Pile of... Okay, a pile of dirt. Box of dirt. Dirt box. Fascinating. What does this say? Who knows? The blinking's starting to hurt my eyes a little bit. Plant? Plant? At this point, I think they're popping up that little hey, click here icon just to fuck with me. Because nothing happens when I do it. And then it's just gone. Like I did something and I didn't. Now what do we do? What? See? See, look. It's just like popping up randomly. Why? From the door? Hello? Reach in and grab it. You ding dong. What do I do now? They did not have a warning. They did not. Oh, God. When will it end? Do we walk back and get killed by a zombie? I'm not sure. I can't seem to click on anything, so... I'm kind of stumped. Do we try this one again? What? What? Says who? That's... You can't just keep replaying the sound effect of the cart. The cart's not moving! You can't play the sound effect again. Uh. Hmm. 
I'm really trying. I'm really trying not to bail out and be like, okay, we're done, unplayable. But it's starting to reach that point where I really don't know what else to do because I can't see well. And uh, I can't click on anything. I can't interact with anything. And the blinking is really frustrating. Does my light need batteries? No, I don't think so. What is this? Why do I need emotes? Let's try dropping it. Look at it, it's still blinking. I'm not even holding it. We'll go back to the first hallway and die, and then I guess we'll call it a day. Hmm? Sound good? Shut up. Hey. What you doing that for, huh? What you doing that for? Can I shoot him? I want to shoot him. What's the point of a gun if I can't shoot no one? Am I right, ladies? I'm just going to get his business. Here we go. Wow. Dead. The, the light's giving me a headache and making me nauseous. We're done. <laughs> We're done. <laughs> that's it. No respawn. I think that's enough. I think that is enough. I mean, I... What else am I supposed to do? That's it. I can't... I also can't handle the blinking anymore. And, um... I didn't know what else to do. I was stumped. That flashing is beyond words. Yeah, I don't get it. Uh, um, all right, honest review. Uh, unplayable. <laughs> Hardly a game. Uh, too unplayable for me to discover the cool spooky stuff, which is a shame because the zombie and the bathtub and the doll, fun, fun stuff, very classic. Unplayable. I don't know what I'm doing wrong or what I'm missing, but that's also the point. There's no instructions, so... I have no idea what to do. <laughs> and selecting things is not working half the time. It says press E, press keyboard E or click the icon. First off, I'm pressing E and it's not doing things. And clicking on an icon on the screen when my mouse is being used as my focal point doesn't exactly work. So I don't know what the plan was here, but I honestly feel almost like I've been pranked. It's that bad. And I don't tend to be very harsh about horror games, but I do feel maybe like this was a prank, like I'm being trolled, you know? Is That's how much of a non-game this feels like. Like, I'm being so serious. <laughs> Many reviews agree. Yeah, I didn't want to spoil it or taint my opinion, but... I feel like they they just contacted a bunch of content creators and asked people to play it, um, knowing full well that it's like it's a non-game. I don't know what the point of that would be, but yeah, it feels kind of shit posty. Yeah, <laughs> maybe it's an an honesty test. Maybe it is. Maybe it is because there are some people. But this thing, I think some people are like, "Ooh, I'm in on the joke. I'm gonna leave a review that I loved it." And then I'm in on the joke, because I've seen people do that before with games, which I don't personally care for, because I am too naive. Uh, all right, well, the character selection was cool, and the, that's the thing. That's why I really do think it was a prank, because the character selection screen and the characters and all of that, and even the cover image. The cover image is so squeaky clean and crispy and fun to look at. It looks interesting. The characters were fun. And then you get into the game and it is mind blowing. I am shocked and also sorry guys. I, I specifically didn't want to research it more because I wanted to experience it raw, but I should have I should have had it checked out first before we played it. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. <laughs> that was horrible. That was so bad. And you know what's funny? That company sent me another email, I think today, suggesting I play a different game by them, which was not horror at all. It was some, like, I don't know, a non-horror game. And I was like, that's kind of weird of them to do. Why would they do that? I'm not a horror gamer. But it's happened before. I mean, I am a horror gamer. I'm not a 
whatever type game it was. And I thought it was weird. And now it starts to make sense. Hmm. Should definitely reiterate the use of, of a warning before the flashing. It hurts super bad. It was just like, I agree. At the, even if it's a prank, just let us know. But that flashing was absolutely brutal. It is so hard on the eyes. Like, prank or not, dude. You made funny content out of it. We could chat, so it's not that bad. That's, um, yeah, silver lining. Silver lining. Seems more like an art project. I do think it's, it's something. I, it sure is something. Maybe like a like a social experiment. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. All right. Hell yeah. Let's see what it is. You want to see? What do you mean? Like the second game they uh, they told me about? Cause I don't want to bother. It's not even horror. It's like, what was it? I'm gonna look up what it was. Anyway, I'm gonna put music back on. And um. Yeah, that was that. <laughs> Another weird stream that I'm gonna have to take down. God damn. Homegirl just cannot get a win. But you know what? I should have seen this coming. I should have seen it coming. I really should have. Like, what the heck? All right, let me, um, let me switch over to the email. Yeah, what's this other one? Blitz Runner. Now I gotta see what it is. Why does Blitz Runner look fun though? Blitz Runner looks like it's actually fun. Is it a prank? No, this is fun. Leave it up. Your stream will pop up. Okay, <laughs> fair. Yeah, that's that's uh yeah that's hard on the eyes and a non-game and not playable and really did. I do. I genuinely do have a headache actually. I'm. I'll power through, but I do have one. So this is the other game, Blitz Runner, and like it looks cute and I'm I'm too big. It looks cute and fun, right? Doesn't it look like you know silly and cute, but a good time. But now, oh, that's probably where these weird little characters are from. That's why it's in the. Do you do you think it really was a prank, or do you think it was like did I do something wrong? I really don't know. Man. I hope it's not a prank. I don't like that. Yahaha Studios. Dude, Beautiful Nightmare was so bad. Hide and seek, you found me. That's interesting. Like, these are the images, right? We saw that. Let's look through. I never got to, I never got to shoot anything. Doesn't look like he's shooting either. Never saw any of that. There's not a whole lot to see. We know this hallway. There's not a whole lot to see in these images anyway. Saw that. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh, which you can't interact with even though he's holding a key. That's the front door. Oh, we didn't see a piano. Hmm, I see some patterns repeating in this one too. Yeah, it looks like a rejected. <laughs> looks like a Roblox game. Rejected N64. <laughs> hey, it was an experience. We all had a good time. And, um, I got a little bit smarter. I'll be a little bit more <laughs> untrusting. Um,. Why is everyone like, why does everyone else have gameplays where they played it? Is it me? I don't, I don't know. <sighs> this game is cool. It's a bit lacking, but it was fun. That's it. What? Is everyone else having a better time at this than me? Or are you liars? I feel, I feel, I don't know. Is everyone having, I wanna have fun too. I wanna have fun too. What did I do wrong? I don't know what I did wrong. I 
do you have to have other people? I, all right, I'm gonna open it one more time. I'm gonna open it one more time. I'm gonna, hang on, I don't know. I, I just, I have to, I don't know. I, I can't, one more time. Did you hear that? No, not the flashing. <laughs> I'm not gonna make you look at the flashing. I just wanna see if I missed something when setting up the game. I, I don't know. I at least wanna finish the demo. I think you and me, maybe. All right, let's try it. Let's just try to open it one more time. Let's just try to open it. Like this is not what the game looked like. That is not what it looked like. Are you, are you live commenting? Sure, do it. Whatever that is, turn it on too. Give it all to me. I don't know. Room list. There's no space available. Try to join one with quick start. So they say this horror game has a single creator who used their studio, so it's not the same people as Blitz. What? Do I? Yeah, maybe I need people, but nobody's playing it, so there's no one to play with? Click speaker to switch between audio channels and space. I don't know what that means. Oh, I don't need that. Thank you. Cry. I cry. Punch? Wait, did I punch before? I don't know. Did I? Maybe I did. I'm punching now. Bam. Bam. Maybe I could have fought the zombie. Bam. Well, now when I try to do it, I'm not even punching. I'm just whatever this is, which is not shooting a gun, just to be clear. is that okay you know we're not oh oops I couldn't help myself uh oh oops I fell backwards into the game again what on earth all right no I'm not doing this I'm not doing this I have some self-respect <laughs> we're done we're done with that it's over I can't. They got you again. I can't do it. They did. They wrote me. I just couldn't. I couldn't believe. So that's it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what else to say. Um, that was my attempt to play Beautiful Nightmare. I really did. I really tried my best. That was so hard on the eyes. Even before the blinking, it was hard on the eyes. Half the time, the, the E button and the clicking just doesn't work at all. So I I don't even, I can't even give it a review as a game because it wasn't. It was not even a game. It was like, I couldn't get far enough to even have a gaming experience. I mean, gaming requires, I think, like I like walking simulators, but that's not even what that, what I, there's so many issues with it. And aside from all the technical issues of like the details and buttons not working and my perspective really being hard on the brain and the eyes and the blinking, fundamentally like what is the game, the story? I, st I have no idea, it doesn't feel like there was one. Even with the little bit we played, I'm like, I don't even know why I'm doing what I'm doing. I don't know why I'm a Fortnite character struggling to open doors with zombies and the Virgin Mary and an acid bath and a church and I woke up in a bed. It's a, and don't you dare just say, ooh, it's a, it's a, oh, it's a beautiful nightmare. Oh, cause it's a dream. Cause it's a nightmare. Oh. Oh, oh, cause, cause it's, cause it's a beautiful nightmare. Cause it's a bad dream. Cause that's why everything makes no sense. Cause it's a beautiful nightmare. And they actually already told us that with the title. So it's actually not that unforgivable, but but I think that that is a cheap, I think that's a cheap out. I think to be like, oh, well, it's a dream, so it doesn't have to make any sense or have a story is cheap. Because that felt so confusing, but also 
bare and empty. I felt like you were giving me nothing and I was still confused by it. And I couldn't even play it. And that's the part that kills me because I don't mind something having no story and being like weird and dumb. I love weird and dumb. I just want to play. I wanted to give it a fair shot so bad. I wanted to be, I wanted to give it a fair shake and potentially like it so badly. And the fact that they didn't even let me is the part that hurts me the most because I play things to have fun. It is starting to pour. Anyway, that's my review. <laughs> One star, not even a game. People gave it a chance. I, I really, I, I gave it a real chance. I really wanted to like it and actually play it and they wouldn't let me. That makes me crazy. I'm not even here to shit on things. I like to play games. I wanna like everything. Why are we here? Where, where we are? Who you play? What's the goal? Why are we here? just to suffer i've had dreams with better gameplay and story me amen period me too well i guess um so that's that that's what i was uh planning to do i gotta go meet some friends for dinner i know i are all friends who'd have thought me having friends not me um but seriously, the lights. The lights were absolutely uncalled for. I think that's the final line where it's like, yeah, okay, it's not good, but the lights were just really... And blinking lights don't usually bother me, but that was really tough, so... It's, it's not... It's almost a waste of time to talk about all the things that we didn't like because that's everything. I can't tell you what I did like. You know what? The opening screen where we chose a character, that was fun. But that was it. It's like there's there's almost nothing to like there's no substance so uh and it was weird and the fortnite emotes and the stickers i don't know i don't know weird i i yeah so that's my review we played it here it is those are my thoughts <laughs> i feel like i i genuinely think i've been pranked i genuinely think i've been trolled by it um and if not then damn then damn holy crap please work on the game because if that's not a prank, <laughs> then Jesus Christ. That's it. That's all I've got to say. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out and talking with me and experiencing that with me. I'm so glad I didn't experience that alone. So thank you. Also, sorry for the headaches and the nausea. Couldn't I, I should have looked into it. That's, on, that's my bad. All right, I'm going to go. Thanks again. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Pew.
Stop.